Pro. Good morning, guys. Today is Saturday. It is the 3rd of March. We have pretty much been hit with a snowstorm here in the UK. We haven't had it too bad here in Blackburn and unfortunately as a result of the snow and the fact that Margarita lives in Glasgow and has to travel down from Scotland through very snowy areas, we've had to postpone our posing and our bikini try on until further notice. So hopefully we'll get it in before the competition because I really could do with some help with my posing. I'm not too concerned about getting the bikini to me too quickly because, you know, I've got plenty of bikinis. But I was looking forward to meeting Margarita, spending some time with her and just kind of ear bashing her and getting information about the competition, how the day runs, um, about tanning, etc. Because I don't really have a clue. So I think I'll just have to phone bash her with questions. Update on my weight. I've had the same macros again this week as I had last week. I've had five low days so today is my higher carb day. I've done two hit cardio sessions and two low impact cardio sessions and my weight has steadily dropped this week. So last week I was weighing in on my lowest day at 115 pounds. This was fine. I was still dropping weight steadily. This week and today I've had a new low weigh-in of 112.8 pounds. I had a call with my coach area on the week. If you watched my previous video, um, you saw that I had a call with my coach and we discussed what was gonna happen this week and next week in the weeks coming. I don't think my macros are going to be adjusted this week because I've seen such a good drop this week of over two pounds. So I think that maybe next week we might get a bit more tough on me, but I think right now I've had such a good drop this week. I'm so happy. I've started taking in more water. So I was probably taking in between two to two and a half liters of water a day and i've made sure all this week that i've gotten in three liters of water not including like teas and coffees and anything like that i'm just talking about actual straight water so i've been pushing myself to get in the water i'm obviously peeing way more i think that might have helped just with like water weight i did have my period last week which would have had me up on the scales a little bit and I feel like it just helps keep me full as well and just feeling better. Nothing else significant has changed. I think just sometimes your body goes through phases where it's like holding on to the fat, which it was a couple of weeks ago, and now it's starting to drop it. And I definitely am feeling a lot leaner. The weather hasn't been too bad around here. We've been able to get out to the gym, apart from one day where I did an at-home workout. I've been able to get out to the gym and train. So today I'll probably go to the gym, do a quad session, because it's the weekend, and quads it's always my weekend workout and I might try on one of my old bikinis for you guys and show you how shit I am at posing so I made an attempt at making red velvet cupcakes they are pretty good but it was just a first attempt and I am going to work on it to try and improve it the macros are really good on them but um, I will be adjusting them slightly in my next attempt I might try and make them again later today or tomorrow. You can see the pink coming through. Now the secret ingredient, Ooh, I'm not sharing that with you guys, because I want you to go and watch my cooking videos. So you can see that there is actual little rose petals on top to make it really pretty. But I'm going to go and have one of these right now. I made these in place of my carrot cake muffins for this week, and I'm gonna have a coffee. And I'm gonna make Lex a cup of tea, because he's up. What's that doing? Roxy. Rox. Loki coffee. Breakfast time is here and, and I'm gonna have one of my toasted breakfast muffins with some bacon, some black pudding, some scrambled eggs, and I'm gonna put it in these muffins these wholemeal muffins from tesco's now they're a bit stale they're not gone off but they're gone a bit hard so my trick for bringing them back to life you take the muffins and you wrap them in a damp piece of kitchen paper put it in the oven and it brings it back to life it just brings the moisture back into it makes it soft and then you can toast it tip of the day 
Here we have my breakfast sandwich, scrambled egg whites with cheese, some bacon, some black pudding on that refreshed wholemeal toasted muffin. I just ran upstairs to get a battery for my camera, so I'm out of breath. Oh, and I made Lex one as well because I'm a good wife. He has egg, some black pudding. These are better than McDonald's breakfast muffins, definitely, and a lot healthier. That's lovely. That, that's really good quality, isn't it? Ooh, why isn't that full? That's better. Now we're no, crystal clear. Now look how gorgeous you are at two o'clock in the afternoon. It's not two o'clock yet. What time is it? Twenty-four minutes past one. Okay. Well, <laughs> oh, a whole thirty-six minutes. There's yours. Cheers. There's mine. These got small. Yeah, but they taste better. They're way better now. The Dr. Zach's cookies are the best. And we got a milky one for me because it's high carb day. Woo! I waste all my carbs on milk. And Lex gets a creamy one. You done? Oh, okay. God. No, it's not. Not that small. This is the current situation. I'm in my old bikini, which has lost a lot of its diamantes. And I'm in shoes made from hell. They're just so, so painful. Why? I only had them on for about 10 minutes. <sighs> okay, so since Margarita didn't make it, she's actually gonna come in three weeks time. So not that far away. So she's gonna come in three weeks time, which gives me two weeks after she comes to practice. That's probably her messaging me now. And in the meantime, I'm going to try and work on my routine and then she can kind of perfect it then for me closer to the date. I'm just gonna do some posing to show you how shit I am because I practice a bit then I went onto YouTube and watched previous PCA competitions, realized I was doing my side pose completely wrong. So I'm gonna have to rethink that. And my front pose is pretty shit too. And so is my back pose. So that's pretty much every quarter turn is shit. But we're gonna work on that because we've got five weeks. <laughs> Well then through the crunchy cheese sticks. Trying to warm up before we go to the gym. Hang on with this one. Do a different gym. Called um, Better Bodies. Better bodies to get me a better body. Not butter bodies. <laughs> gym bound. I haven't done this in a while. A bit of a vlog in the car. So interactive. What? Try and not to crash into small walls and other people. It tends to be the goal of when you drive.
gym. I need to warm up. So I got myself a massive cup of coffee. Mm. I'm so cold. Post workout snack we've got a corn thin with some of this Dr. Zach salted caramel peanut butter and some of this yummy wild blueberry jam. Got two of them on the go. And this will keep me going until dinner. I haven't decided what I'm gonna have. I have minced chicken and I have regular chicken. So I don't know what to make. I might make some kind of chicken taco. Yeah. So it's a Saturday night dinner and I've got a big frying pan full of chicken and veggies. I just wanted to bulk it up with loads of veggies because I'm feeling quite hungry and I felt like that would fill me more than having sweet potato or rice or something like that. So I've really packed it full with pak choy, asparagus, butternut squash, acorn squash, um, what else have I got in there? Peppers, mushrooms, asparagus, got some chicken and I've literally just marinated it in um, some seasoning basic seasoning and I've used some of this um, apple cider vinegar apparently it has loads of health benefits so I've been using this in my veggies and I've been putting it into my omelet in the morning so hopefully I'll get super healthy from having my apple cider vinegar every day and I just added a little bit 15 grams of the lightest Philadelphia just to add a little bit of extra creaminess to it yummy I love them they're so yummy as you can see I look gorgeous no I'm I've got a spot there a spot there big black rings under my eyes I'm really cranky it's not the best thing in the world to prep <laughs> makes you short tempered I feel like I could punch someone in the face at any moment not even that hungry I'm just really really angry most of the time <laughs> and on that note I'm gonna leave you guys and I'll check in with you during the week. Lex is away, so I might actually film some recipes for my recipe channel and I'll do an update again on my crankiness. Cause if I only had a hundred fans, I take them all to dinner, talk about the people that we used to be.